In the fight against COVID, not all masks are created equal. Here's why some work better than others. It all comes down to the materials your mask is made from. A recent study from Stanford University showed that woven materials like cloth masks block between 10 and 35% of viral droplets. This wide range of effectiveness depends on several factors like thread count, layers, and material. Masks made from non-woven materials are the most effective in the fight against COVID-19. Surgical masks are commonly made from a plastic material called polypropylene. This plastic generates an electric charge which attracts foreign particles and prevents them from slipping through the mask. But because they are not tight fitting, they're between 90 and 95% effective. N95 style respirator masks are considered to be the best at blocking virus particles. They filter out at least 95% of small and large airborne particles. They have a denser network of fibers than surgical or cloth masks, and the edges of the respirator are designed to form a seal around your nose and mouth. The N95 filter is physically around 0.3 micron in size. A viral particle is much smaller than that, but these particles usually attach to something larger, like a really small water droplet that's generated by breathing, talking, or coughing. Similar to surgical masks, the N95 respirator also uses electrostatic absorption, meaning particles are drawn to the fiber and trapped in it instead of passing through it. This is why health experts suggest you discard these after one use. The difference between the N95, KN95, and KF94 masks comes down to where the mask is certified. N95 masks, the US standard, must pass a rigorous inspection from the National Institute for Occupational Safety and Health. KN95s and KF94s, the China and South Korea standards, may or may not be FDA approved depending on the manufacturer. To be approved, manufacturers must provide documentation that the materials used are authentic. If you can't get your hands on an N95 mask, double up. In a CDC lab test, wearing a cloth mask over a surgical mask decreased exposure to potentially infectious aerosols by about 95%. Hey, thanks for watching. If you like this video, check out these other videos from USA Today to stay up to date with all the latest news.